Hi, um, just wanted to make a short video about the difference between the normal Nanopresso and the Nanopresso elements. Um, I get a few customers asking questions about, you know, what's the difference between the two products. So I thought I'd do a short video just to kind of show show what they look like and, you know, talk a little bit about what the differences really are. Um, so with the old Nanopressos, you had you know, a few different colours. Um, you had the normal grey one, um, which is this one here. And, you know, the boxing, the carton is pretty much the same. Um, and then you would have the orange one. Now these colours here were called the patrol colours. So you've got the orange, which looks like that. And then you would have the yellow, which is the yellow patrol. And that looks like this. And then you would have the red, which is this one. And this is called the red patrol. And that looks like that. Okay, now Wakako have stopped manufacturing these colours, um, the old colours. I'm pretty sure that they don't do the red anymore and I'm pretty sure that they don't do the orange anymore and I'm quite confident that they don't do the yellow anymore. Um, what they're doing is they're just doing the normal dark grey colour. So if you go to Wakako's website you won't see anything for those colours apart from the grey nanopresso. And what I think they've done is they're concentrating on the new colours, which are the nanopresso elements. And that's what these are. Okay, now, the unit inside here, the actual physical unit, the nanopresso, is just the same. It's the same as the other normal nanopresso, which is this one, the normal one from the original box is like this and the elements is just the same it's literally the same product but in a hard case so what they're doing is they've they've created some different colors for the nanopresso elements so you've got the arctic blue which is this one and again that gets the case included this one, the chill white, which again you can see on the cover there, it's got the, the case included in this. And then you've got this one here, which is the lava red. And I don't think Wakako, right now they don't do these nano pressos without the hard case included. You can't buy them separately. separately and they do, obviously, they cost a little bit more than just a normal nanopresso because you have the, the hard case included. You can buy the, the original hard case, the small hard case that fits these products, but you can only buy that in the black color like this, this hard case for the normal dark gray nanopresso. You can't buy these cases for the colored, the colored nanopresso, the elements, separately you can't buy them they'll only come in the box like this so you can't you can't purchase those separately maybe in the future they'll they'll do something about that maybe they'll start selling them separately for people you know who want to buy them separately um i can't see really a good reason to do that if they don't sell the unit separately then obviously people are going to get this case with the package so again it's kind of confusing right now but that's what you get Okay, the original Nano Presso, you get this cloth, cloth kind of sack here with a, a pull tie. And that's what you get with that. The material's quite okay. It, you know, it does the job, but it's not, like I say, it's not like the, the hard case. And inside the original Nano Presso, you get this kind of packaging where the, the unit fits in there. And then you get these, you get their stickers, and you get... A warranty card with a, obviously a QR code and the registration underneath here. I don't want to kind of pull this off too much so you can see the serial number. But you do get, you know, a, a serial number that you scan uh, the QR and then go to their website and input the serial number for your for your warranty. So you get that with all of their products. If you don't get something like that, 
and chances are you've got a fake product because they all all of them now come with this older versions of these products i believe they didn't ship they didn't ship with a serial number they just had this card the warranty card and that's what you got and you get obviously the the manual and it's a good manual it you know it kind of shows you pictures and it explains quite well how to use it and it's in several languages so you get that with the old one okay and then with the new ones you get again the same but the stickers now for the elements will reflect what color they are these will be different colors for each each product in that the gray one the dark gray one obviously is like the old sticker for for the original dark gray so there's no difference in color there and obviously you get the manual and the warranty card with that so again there's no difference apart from the stickers are a different color the case for these are really nice it's a nice little product that you've got here with a nice finish the the trim around them is obviously reflective of each color that you've got there as you can see the white has got the white and the, the arctic blue has got like the blue ring around there they've got a pull tab on that which is a nice nice finish and it's good sturdy material um the box the case sorry itself is it's quite a nice little case inside they've got a lining which is nice soft material so it doesn't doesn't damage the product there um actual product itself again is it's good sturdy material it's, it's a good product they've got a like a cardboard kind of tab there a, a, sorry a, a, like a information label that kind of tells you a little bit of about it um, so that's different to the original nano presso you didn't get that you just got the unit in, in the actual hard case so that's a nice little touch um, like I say the grey one it's, it's just the same but it doesn't have obviously any colour around the side there it's just a nice little nice little grey um, hard case um, and that's it basically I mean as far as the product is it's, it's a good sturdy product there's not a lot can actually go wrong with these products there's a few things that I always tell my customers to be aware about when they're using them um, like the grind size is quite important um, I've sold a lot of these products and usually if I get any problems with them it's down to maybe two or three different things um, the grind size uh, needs to be slightly more coarse than a typical espresso grind size um, usually people when they buy their coffee from a supermarket it, it's really really fine um, kind of like like flour it's, it's not really good so when you put them in here and the first thing they do is they'll overfill it and then they'll tamp it down really hard and then when you screw the the head on there it's got like a gasket um, head inside and when you screw this on it kind of pushes the coffee down a little bit too much sometimes and then they have problems pumping it because the water can't pass through it it's just too hard so you know a slight adjustment in the grind size to make it a little bit like a, how to say um, a medium fine grind size is ideal for these units and, and that's basically it there's not really a lot can go wrong with these they're a good sturdy product the good material they they take a few knocks um, they don't break that easily it's a good product and then obviously with the actual hard case you can carry them around quite confidently um, take them camping with you take them to work and they look nice they're a good product so basically that's it really oh sorry there is another color in the elements there's a, a moss green which is a really nice nice kind of military style green color and i've sold out of them right now i sell a lot of them and they seem to be quite popular right now um but yeah that, that's the colors in the elements and and that's basically it as i say these colors here you can't get them on the website um, they're just not doing them anymore. Um, I've still got I've still got these colours because I ordered a load of them, and and I've still got them in stock. So I'm still selling these colours through through Meet the Coffee. Um, if anybody's interested in that, you know they, they can purchase them through me online. Um, and that's it. Basically, anybody's interested in you know any any information on it, please drop me a line or leave a comment, and I'm always happy to answer any questions about these. 
Um, I'm not endorsed by Wakako, but I usually I make these videos just to help my customers out if they've got any problems. So yeah, please feel free to contact me and I'll, I'll happy to answer any questions. So yeah, thank you, thank you for watching.